Once again, here we are with Dale Perkins, SanFranciscoWatercolors.com. Watercolors by Dale Perkins, and we're at the uh, San Francisco Bay, Hyde Street, at the cable car turnaround. And you'll notice there are a lot of people here waiting to get on the cable car. And you can imagine this is one of the big sites of San Francisco. Also a place where Dale hung out when he was a child. Hey, Dale, tell us about this place. What, what excites you about this? Hey, look at the people standing in line. This is their first time. As a kid, I was here almost every other weekend. It's just a fun place to be. So, you know, when you were growing up, was it always crowded like this? Did they still want to dry, ride the cable car? Uh, it depends upon the day. I've got paintings early in the morning uh, of scomas and so on. And so it depends when you're here. So I guess cable cars, Golden Gate Bridge, San Francisco Skyline, I guess those are the major things of San Francisco. Is that your memory or is it much more than that? Mm, well, it's much more only because I knew the people, I knew the kids, and I saw them grow up, I saw them become healthy, happy, successful people. That's part of the whole thing. Well, you know, we're curious as to what makes an artist so successful like you've been. Is it because you have an affinity for this city that makes your painting so vibrant? You have to have a passion for painting, number one. If you don't have that, then forget it. And you have to keep painting whether you feel successful or not, because that's not a that's a, that's a given word. You just have to keep, keep going on what you like and what you want to pursue. Well, it's clear that you really uh, love the city. You're passionate about the city. We can tell that by the number of paintings you've done of San Francisco and your collection that's online. What's the next thing for you? you have a thing in mind? Uh or something you haven't done that sounds pretty interesting? I can't find enough time to paint the things I want to paint. Uh, and that, that's the truth. I think if you're an artist, you, you could be, have, have as much joy painting a tennis shoe as anything else. But the city has endless venues that are always there waiting to be painted. Well, we, we look forward to seeing the next one. We thank you uh, for your time. We thank you for your great paintings, uh, for your love for this city that you grew up in. And uh, as I say goodbye here, I'm just going to take a span of San Francisco. But thanks again, Dale, and have a great day. Thanks. Well, there's just no denying that this city has special memories for so many people. It's a beautiful city. It's got so many places to visit. And once again, uh, what an honor to have this time to speak with Dale Perkins to talk about what inspires him and how he continues to build his repertoire of paintings of San Francisco and the vibrancy that they create.